Your team played absolutely spectacular, especially in that first half of the game. You guys went up to as much as 17 point lead. How did you feel? Um, to be honest, it felt like it was just a regular game, to be honest. I just wanted to get the win and upset these guys in their own gym, to be honest. That's all. You had eight players, so only three guys on the bench. Did fatigue play a role in this? Not, not at all, not at all. Because we, our conditioning our, on our gym is really, and our practices are really good. So, I don't think so. Moving on to your next game, what are we going to expect from this Bill Crothers team? A W, a win, and to, uh, I guess to finish our game stronger. O'Shea, you guys didn't have a very great start to your game. You went down as, as much by uh, 17 points at one point. What was happening at the beginning of that game for you guys? Um, we just came out sloppy as a team. Um, we underestimated them. See, we saw that they had about eight players. We felt like we could run on them, and, but that wasn't the case. We had to execute and play defense, and it, it took some guts to do that. The O'Shea that we saw at the beginning of the game versus the O'Shea that we saw have a fire lit under him at the beginning of that second half. What kind of lit that fire for you? Uh, I just felt like it was my job to bring the team together and pump us up. You know, by getting to the basket, dunking and all that, that gets the team hyped. So that's my job to do that. So that's what I try to do. At the end of the game, when it started to get closer, there were some words talking between the two teams. Is this going to be a year-long rival? Uh, that's just how basketball is. Every game. Every time it's close, everyone wants to get under everyone's skin. So, I mean, those guys are still my friends. I still talk to them, but it's just, just basketball. Awesome. Congratulations. Thank you.